So let's talk about twos and the flavors that they bring through the wings and the subtypes. First, their wings, you could either be a two with a one wing or two with a three wing. A two with a one wing, I don't know if Mother Teresa fits this, but our perception of this is she does, just a true servant. They are principled and objective when they're walking with the Lord. When they're not, though, they can get more guilty and self-critical quite a bit. Uh, Sam Wise Gamgee in the Lord of the Rings trilogy written by J.R.R. Tolkien is a great example of a two with a three wing, often called a host or hostess. When they're doing well, they're very ambitious and confident. When they're not, can be a little bit deceptive and vain. Just uh, love both two different flavors of how they help people. Now, the subtypes um, are three. Now, remember, you have a primary subtype and a secondary. And usually the third one, even though it's in you as a two, it's kind of you're turned off to it. It's a, it's a blind spot for you. So it's helpful to look, know these. First of all is a self-preservation two. It doesn't actually look as much on the surface like a two or like what you would think it would be. That's why we call it a countertype. This countertype is a seducer to get their own needs met, and they fear being rejected. And so because um, they being told no is a form of a rejection, they can be a bit indirect in how they ask for their needs to be met. They can lure people into being needy and irresponsible to get others' attention or to get their help or to help them. Uh, they can be playful, though, very charming, and have a childlike demeanor. Now, a one-to-one, -one, too, is we often call the lover. You know, I probably, uh, in the sense of romantic sense, comes to mind. You pretty much should get this. This uses seduction to uh, entice a partner to get their needs met. So they really love these one-to-one -one connections with somebody else. This feels like love and intimacy to them. And then, you know, they're very inspirational. And they can give off good feelings and passion to have that need for love and admiration met. Uh, they present themselves as irresistible. And when their seduction works, they are inflated, but will feel deflated if it's not. So... Um, that is a one-to-one -one subtype. The social, we often call the ambassador. This one has a desire for more power and influence uh, over the people that are around them. They're very generous and sure that people will follow them and appear influential and competent. And in order to feel loved, they will make themselves uh, indispensable to family, friends, and colleagues. They're supportive, they give advice, they help the community. Um, they may resemble uh, a type three or a type eight a little bit more than a two because of the way they carry themselves off. So those are a little bit of the flavors of a two, the wings and the subtypes.